Good evening, everyone. How y'all doing out there? Thank y'all so much for tuning in again to the Real Deal Fam Network. Uh, I'm Andre. This is my beautiful wife, Essie. Hello. And we're so happy again to have y'all here with us this evening. Uh, we would like so much if y'all would continue your support by subscribing and hitting that like button and also hit that notification bell. So in the future, when any videos we put out, you'll be definitely the first one to know. Mm -hmm. All right, so with all that out of the way, let's jump right into the video. Today, we got a special video Juicy coming. Juicy topic. <laughs> There's a special holiday coming up for couples, one that's very near and dear to our heart, being that we've been married for several years. It, uh, what we want to talk to y'all about today is like the do's and don'ts of Valentine's Day uh, for married couples. You got to take his own advice. <laughs> <laughs> it's easier said than done, fellas, but it's something we got to do if you want to uh, win the heart of your young lady. So, Keep uh, the heart of your young lady. <laughs> win it. Oh, yeah. Well, it, either way it go, you need to do both. <laughs> 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 but uh, I think number one, first thing is plan, plan, plan. Plan. Plan and you He's can't the plan worst enough. At but uh, like the old adage says, a, a man who fails to plan uh, plans to fail. So it, it, it's always true. It always shows its nasty head every time I failed to plan. Uh, things Most didn't work time. out. <laughs> I've tried last minute to put What's something your together. Plan this year? Uh, that's top secret. It's yeah. still early, Not so that. Listen, <laughs> <laughs> do as I say. I, I do. <laughs> well, anyway, definitely you want to make sure you put a plan together, have your stuff organized and, and ready to go. Uh, it, it, women have this keen sense. Of, of knowing when you just threw something together at the last minute. King said, <laughs> but they know when we didn't put any effort into it and we just tried to skate by. His first Valentine's Day, he got me some lotions and stuff off the side of the road. <laughs> well, uh, I'm like, I don't those, those, out. those folks put a lot of Throw care into making them baskets. So all I want, <laughs> <laughs> I want to support them. I wasn't quite aware. You know, I was new, Jack. Me and her had just uh, got together. And uh, I, I wasn't aware that the ladies didn't like those things, that they was kind of like use cheap ingredients from various stores and stuff. So once she made me uh, knowledgeable of that type of thing, I, I didn't do it anymore. You're right. <laughs> just try something like cheaper. <laughs> 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 they, they give you a hard time, bro, but... Just, just hang in there. I'm down. like, just listen to what your woman said. I tell you, I want a Louis Vuitton or, uh, you know, even just a nice little piece of jewelry or, you know, just a thought. Write me a poem, any little thing. So, that, that is absolutely. Don't claim broke on the day. <laughs> that is an absolute perfect segue to the second one, which is just listen to your spouse. They typically always say what they want. And what they don't want. Don't I typically get you what you desire? She does. She does. She does a very great job of that. Uh, me Not and just material things, but I also just make time for you. Listen to the things that you want and make sure that everything, you know, if, if it's my time to plan, it's planned out. Because I take time right. to think about it. She's really good at that. So <laughs> she's always very attentive to uh, my various needs. And she knows the things that I like, things that I don't like. The moment I don't. <laughs> But yeah, so the fellas, we typically have to do a better job at that. And so that's that's one of the, the, the don'ts you don't want to get into. You definitely want to be a good listener. Listening to your wife, listen to your spouse or your significant other. They're going to always say the things they like. Uh, that's tend to be a big problem in relationship. Ladies tend to figure that uh, I'm, I'm always talking, I'm always giving signals, but uh, they just going on on deaf ears. So mm -hmm. uh, I had to buy my own Louis. <laughs> Don't believe that one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> they know me very well. So no, that ain't true. But definitely that that uh, always listen. Uh, people tend to like to give, especially her. Uh, when we first start dating, um, we would I would always buy gifts and things. 
And she would be like, oh, that's nice. And then she was like, you still got the receipt? <laughs> <laughs> so she tend to take back all my gifts. So. <coughs> Excuse me. But that that definitely, if, if you listen, over time I learned to listen. So I stopped buying. It's a waste of money. I'm not going to wear it or use it. It is, it is. Uh, we don't have got past niceties. That, <laughs> well, that's true. So Just I, buy the thing I want. So I learned to listen, and it, it, it definitely pays in the long run. Uh, you think I'm doing a better job of that now, huh? Mm, most times these days. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, but definitely. Uh, also, there's another thing. The third thing I think is very key is uh, Valentine's is a very intimate holiday. It's a time that you spend. Talking about a lot of intimacy. Which is significant other. So you don't want to, uh, what I've learned from my wife is she doesn't really like to be out at, at busy public places on those particular occasions. So if you Bad just, service, too many people, is you just don't get the same quality. I'd rather him prepare a meal or something at home. Or we go out the day before or... Yeah, day before or after is kind of late. Right. So you always want to take that into account. So we, we if we're going to do something, uh, she doesn't mind if I plan the day before the holiday, we go out to dinner. If that's part of the whole process, uh, it tends to work better that way. Uh, so uh, try to avoid those places if you can. They're very busy, like she said, more cumbersome and, and tends to take away from the evening. Um, so that you definitely want to stay away from that. Also, mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> a, a very good and very important thing I think you want to do is, is just Valentine's Day is a day that you want to focus on your spouse. So you, you kind of, all the distractions that typically go on on, on different times in, uh, during your week or during your day, mm -hmm. uh, Valentine's Day, put all that stuff aside. That's her day or that's his day and you want to focus on your spouse. You show them all the love, all the appreciation you have for them, uh, that and that you love being with that particular person. And that's what Valentine's Day is. It's just sharing and caring and just a loving day. Uh, how do you feel about that one, honey? Sharing and caring and loving. You've been doing a good job lately with that. I, oh. I, I, yeah, I was surprised. <laughs> mm -hmm. Taking time off of work, you don't have to take time off work, but just de definitely take time for your mate to show them that they're special to you, just like how it was when you first got together. So mm -hmm. he's been doing a lot better with that lately. So I will give you. Oh, wow. thank you, honey. Oh, thank you, honey. No. And it, it does work for you, fella. So you you definitely want to do that. And I I think another thing that really helps. Uh, that really helped me for uh, a day like Valentine's Day is that I just incorporate the deepest love that I have for my wife and appreciation. So if I can do that, everything else kind of flows. It's very easy. Incorporate uh, the deepest love, what you mean? That means all the passion that I have for you, all the, the respect, all the love, I just channel into that, and that just helps Valentine's Day be all the more special to me. You mean you get emotional? Not emotional, but <laughs> to the emotion. <laughs> but it just helps everything. It makes it a lot easier. Typically, guys get to be where holidays uh, are like, oh, that's more work for me. Oh, I got to go out and buy some. Oh, I don't want to go out. And that with me, you don't have to buy something necessarily. You know, that's nice. But uh, it's just the thought. Let's like I told you, you can just take time to make dinner or. You know, write a poem, tell me all that stuff, but uh, definitely making time. But we just hang out, kick it, take a uh, walk around the town center, you know, just him making time and, um, you know. That's right. Don't don't focus on the cows, cost, just focus on your spouse. If you do that, Valentine's Day, I promise you, it'll turn out great. Uh, Y'all have many, many more Valentine days in the future together, and y'all will really appreciate each other and love everything that that, that y'all have built. And it's not just Valentine's Day; you just incorporate that. What you've been doing a lot. Well, that, that's, that's good in you, the daily life. Right. <laughs> so that, that Valentine's Day is not just such a. Uh, heavy load on the Valentine's Day, and then if it's a dud, it's uh, it's problems, you know. 
It's not. It's like anything else. That's why uh, another holiday I used to say, uh, people get all worked up for Christmas, but I used to say for me, every day is Christmas. As long as you handle your business throughout the year, uh, every day is Christmas. You can have all the things you want. So if you, That's another topic. We'll but, it, <laughs> but it's very similar with your wife. If you love your wife, <laughs> respect her, enjoy having time, spending time with her, and appreciate it. And the same applies for her with your husband. Y'all will have a Valentine's Day every day. But uh, just always do that. Just keep each other first and love one another. And Valentine's Day is y'all day. Uh, we do appreciate y'all again the tuning in. If you would, please leave some comments below. Tell us about some of the things you and your significant other plan on doing on Valentine's Day. We highly appreciate it. Yeah, give them some ideas. Plans. <laughs> Don't believe time that. Is a tick, 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 tick. No, I'm all ready. I'm just trying to get y'all ready. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but again, we thank y'all so much for sharing and coming in and supporting us. Uh, I'll hit that subscribe button and that like button. Oh, how come I keep forgetting this every time? I need oh. this. <laughs> this is that, both. There she go again. That's why I can't forget Valentine's Day. <laughs> but uh, again, thank y'all so much, and we look forward to spending more time with you in the future. Black love will continue. Have a good evening.